Welcome to Preventure Adventure, where I'm in a little bit of tight quarters here. I'm in the same spot, but due to what I ordered, it's taken up more room than normal. And tonight finds me at Nino's Pizzeria in Uncasville, Connecticut. A viewer goes by the name of Ant, uh, said I should come down here and check out Grandma's Pie, which is why I have no room. So let me show you what I got. Because I'm at a pizza place. We've got to do the pepperoni pizza. Tough to see, but not much I can do. And then here's the grandma's pie. I love a good grandma's pie. Everyone does them different, though. So let's uh, set up and uh, give it all a try. Okay. It is definitely a, an Italian place. Nino's should tell you that. Let's start with a pepperoni, which uh, has a little crisp going on in the bottom, it sounds like, but not sitting up too well. Nicely done on the bottom, though. And a little on the hot side, which is okay. That's what I want. My kids have always laughed at me because if it's too hot for my hands, I'll put it in my mouth till it cools down. I don't know what to tell you. Very nice crust on this. Nice flavor. Saved. Nice cheese to sauce ratio. I was here once before, back when I was only doing Google Maps. I don't remember being all that impressed, but I gotta tell you, tonight it's looking pretty good. And this isn't even a reason I'm here. I'm here for the grandmas. And here's the grandmas, which is a thicker crust. So I'm looking at it, kind of like an uncooked spot on that crust, but the rest of it's quite good. Nice flavor. Nicely done. All right, let me uh, eat some of this food, come back and tell you what I think. Final thoughts at uh, Nino's Pizzeria here in Uncasville, Connecticut. First, let me say thank you to Ant. I don't know if I would have come back here, and I'm glad you asked me to because, man, I, I really enjoyed this. The uh, regular pizza... Though strangely, didn't quite fit in the box. It was curled up on one end, but hey, what do I know? So anyhow, nice crust, nice flavor, nicely done. Just, just really a good pizza. And the grandma's pie was, was equally excellent. Just really, really good tonight. Um... Just a really good food experience. A guy running the register in there... 
uh, I have a bunch of people working. This guy's like a one-man show. He's ta answering phones. He's taking money. He's doing this. He's doing that. He's dishing out all the food. Um, yeah, it's a Thursday night, and it wasn't super busy, but it was steady. And he was just handling it. So that was pretty cool to watch. So, enough babbling about the place. Really, really good pizza. Um, both of them. Two different styles, but both were were just really nicely done. I would come back here in a heartbeat. No question of a doubt. So the question becomes, do would I recommend it? I definitely would recommend it. So that pretty much solidifies the score in my head for uh, Nino's Pizzeria here in Uncasville, Connecticut. And I would give it a 9.1. Um, I just thought it was very, very good. Very nicely done. And I didn't do anything but pizza. Um, so I can't speak for anything else. But the two different styles of pizza I had, both were excellent. Uh, really enjoyable. So thank you, Aunt. I don't know if you noticed, but I haven't been responding to messages. All of a sudden, it stopped sending them to my email. I didn't realize that, so now I will be doing it through the computer. So I'm back at it. Uh, I've been back at it a little bit by the time you see this video, but I'm back at answering sometimes, depending on what you say. So <laughs> it was one set of brothers. They told me I should do just a meatball series. It just uh, sounds quite intriguing, but I, I don't know. So anyhow, so thanks for that thought, but I, uh, what the heck? Um, anyhow, Nino's Pizzeria, Uncasville, Connecticut, nine point one, worth the trip.